Hey everybody. So now it's time to do something with this because uh uh, I can't do it. So I'm going to use this heat protecting straightening spray from Icy Fantasia. My good old blow dryer. I had that thing for years. Now I also received some new hot tools. This is the electrical straightening comb. I'm using my good old fashioned rat tail comb, a few hair ties, and I also have this Red by Kiss Ceramic Professional Flat Iron, which goes up to 450 degrees. So this is my hair now. Go ahead and spray the protective spray on it, and we'll get started. to part my hair into four sections um, my hair was extremely dry like oh my god I am so embarrassed that I let my hair get this way but it's okay I'm going to take care of it from this moment forward so I'm going to try to get my hair together and stay tuned drying my hair off camera because it was very much time consuming when I use a wild growth hair oil because as I said my hair was in desperate need to be taken care of and my scalp along with my ends and roots was very dry so I'm moisturizing it as much as I can get every part of my hair and scalp and yeah Using any type of hot comb on my hair, so as you saw in the beginning, 
I did burn myself. <laughs> but it's okay, you know. Lesson, lesson becomes something that you learn, and I learned not to be so close to my scalp. <laughs> so go ahead and try to get my roots as good as I can. Get the kitchen. You know we gotta get the kitchen, and then I will split that section into two. Comb it to make sure it's thoroughly detangled, and then I'm going to use the flat iron along with the chase method. As mentioned in the title, I am also clipping my ends because they are in desperate need to be clipped. So I am definitely trimming, as you can see, I'm doing a little length check, but I'm also trying to look and see where the bad ends need to be clipped. So I am still pressing, trimming, and also style.
This is where I knew I messed up right there like that that hot cone is extremely hot it gets up to 500 degrees and excuse the tissue you guys my bathroom doesn't really have much ventilation and with all the heat on top of me being pregnant you sweat a little bit easier or a lot more than an average person so forgive me with the tissue <laughs> trimming repeat so I will see you guys in the next clip
finally finished one half <laughs> of my hair and I like the results I like I love when my hair is easy it's easy to manage and maintain I love when it's straight like this I love it so I'm gonna go ahead and do the other half off camera and then I'll come back when I bump the ends because I don't want my ends to look like this so I'm gonna bump it and I'll be right there. I'll come back when I bump it okay Thanks. all right you guys this is it this is my hair flat ironed stretched hot combed and I'm going to tell y'all, like, this hot comb right here, and no shade to everyone else that's selling um, hot combs. Let me turn you off. No shade to anybody that's selling hot combs and power to you for the black-owned businesses that have hot, uh, hot combs. But, baby, this little thing right here gets hot very fast. I've noticed a few of the um, YouTubers that I watch. Their hot combs go up to 450. Their hot combs don't go up to no more than maybe 475. This little motherfucker right here, 500 degrees. I don't burn my hand. I don't burn certain areas on my hairline and my scalp. When I tell you this little thing get hot, it gets hot. So I will next time when I use it, I'm gonna be very careful. But I'm going to go ahead now and um, bump my ends as promised because I don't want my hair like this. It's straight, but I want it bumped. So if I, I, when I wrap it, it'll still be curled the next day or at least in a style the next day. And I want to keep putting the heat on it. So I'm going to be right back and then... We're going to get to bumping, possibly wrapping. I have some foam in there too. I'm going to show you guys what I'm using for that. And then that will be the end of this video. Alright. Peace. Okay. So right here is the same routine in a way. But instead of four sections, I'm only making two. I'm going to put one side all the way into a ponytail and a hair tie. And I'm just going to make medium sized sections and bump the ends. That's pretty much it.
nice curls, honey. <laughs> Excuse my son, <laughs> but get into these curls. All right, y'all, as you can see, one half is slay. I love how my hair came out. It looks so healthy. Oh my goodness. I cannot wait to do the other half. But as you can see, that's time consuming. So I will come back once I finish so you can see the other half. Like this is the before <laughs> and this is the after. Like, girl, I love it. See the back, see the back. <laughs> I love it. Yes, honey. I'm standing still so it can be a thumbnail. Period. <laughs> yes, I love how it came out. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and do the other half and I'll be right back. <laughs> okay, you guys, this is it. I don't know why it seems that when I do this side, like my my right, your left, when I do my right side, it seems to be a lot longer than me doing my left side, your right. Every time I go off and do my left side off camera, it seems to be a whole lot quicker than when I did my right side. But it's cool. My hair is finally finished, hunty. Get into it. Look at this. Yes, honey. I love my hair. I love it when it's, it's straight and manageable and it's healthy. Like, I really have to get back into taking care of my hair. I've been natural for seven, eight years. I know it should be a lot longer. I know it should be a lot healthier. I've been slacking. I get it. Don't come for me. <laughs> but trust your girls want to get back into it but I, that's why I, I trimmed it and I washed it two days ago I know it's I should have took care of it all of it today but things happen that's out of your control and you just wait for whenever you can do it especially by being seven months pregnant you know I have to you know do what I can when I can so anyway before I start to ramble Get into this hair, honey. Yes, get into it. So one side did drop, like this curl right, this hair piece or this curl right here. I said hair piece, like this is not my hair. <laughs> but this curl right here, it, it's it's literally like trying to drop now. So I'm gonna go ahead and wrap your girl up and call it the day. You guys know how to wrap hair, so I'm not going to do that on camera, but I did want to show you guys my results after using my new hair tool products or my new hot tool products or my new hot tools in general. Um, and as I mentioned in my last video, I did use new uh, products to wash my hair with. I'm going to go ahead and insert that in this video um, just to show you and the next time around when I do another wash and go or I'll wash my hair or the wash day I will show you guys how I do it so one last shot of my hair thank you for watching make sure you like comment and subscribe I will check in with you guys on a few um, in the next video Oh, and I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how much hair I lost. I lost a lot of dead hair, of dead ends, split ends. As you can see, like my hair is shiny and a lot more visual, visible to being healthy. Like it, you can tell it's a lot healthier now. Like look at that. I don't want to shake it too much, but <laughs> I'm going to show you guys how much hair I lost and then that'll that. be that. All right. Eight. That's all the hair I lost. I will say it all together. That's maybe three, probably three inches. Ew. Did 
didn't want to end the video off showing you guys hair or dead hair so again make sure you like comment and subscribe follow me on my social media i'll link everything down in the description box i am very active on my snapchat and my tiktok i'm active on all my social medias but you will see me a lot more on my snapchat and my tiktok so make sure you follow me on there because i am a you think i'm a clown on youtube I'm more goofy and retarded <laughs> on TikTok and Snapchat. So make sure y'all follow me on my social media. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Love y'all. Bye. <laughs>